Hey balance babes, welcome back to my channel. Um, today we're gonna be doing makeup. Okay, per. Um, thank you for everybody who came back. Welcome back, welcome back. I hope you guys are doing great. I hope you guys feel great. Um, thank you for everybody who is here for the first time. Like, I appreciate you guys so much. So, let's get into the nitty gritty, right? So, today, obviously I said we're gonna be doing makeup. I'm gonna be using the Spike Beauty's Creative Expressions palette today for my look. I'm mostly focusing on the red, um, the crimson red in there and the white. And that's because I have an idea that's based off of a nail set. I'm gonna see if I can insert a clip of that nail set here just for the reference. But if not, you know, just vibe with me. Just vibe with me, feel me? So let's get into the makeup. Let's get into the art of it all. Um, it is gonna be like a little abstract, not abstract, but like more detailed. There we go. That's the word I was looking for. Um, but thanks for coming along for the ride, you know? Um, as you can see, I already have my face, um, you know, washed, <laughs> serumed up, primed. You know, we're in tune. We're in tune right now. So, you know, I'm an eye first girl. So let me do my eyebrows and I'm gonna come back and let's get into the eyes. Um, if you wanna see my eyebrow tutorial, it's up on the page, babe. It's up on the page, babe. Even my face tutorial is up on the page, babe. Right? So I got it all for you. I got it all for you. Let's get into what we're doing today, though. Okay, so boom. I made a star on this eye. I'm going to do another star, but I don't think I'm going to have it in the same center focus on my eye and on this side. I think I'm going to put it probably up here and then just have it like in this section. But the way that I did this is I used this little detail brush from the Spike Beauty bundle, their brush bundle collection, and I use this base. It's very neutral, you know, a neutral base, a very neutral color, just so I could carve this out. I recommend a base when doing some type of detail work with shadow, just because if you're doing lines that, you know, you need to make sure are like together, it's like intricate like a star. You should use a base because you can at least, if it's not looking good, you can just blend out the base and start over, you know? So that's where I'm at on this. But I'm gonna now fill this in with this base and then I'm gonna um, go ahead in with the shadow. With this eye, I think I'm going to, la, 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 la. I'm gonna um, do the crimson on this, on this star and then do the white on this star and just have yeah yeah something like that something like that you know but yeah so i'm gonna fill this in i would recommend filling this in with a um a flat brush um i'm gonna probably go in with the brush that i use for my eyebrows just because it had it's you know flat like this and it's like in a square so i can kind of like get those lines really nice in there but yeah so i'm gonna fill this in i'm gonna come back and i'm gonna draw the next star this took me a while, don't get me wrong. Like, it's not something you're gonna get on the first try just because stars are very intricate. Um, but you know, do as many times as you need to. And then, yeah. All right, so boom. We're starred out, we're fanned out now, okay? What we're gonna do, now that we have our stars in place, we want to now fill, in, fill them in, okay? Now remember I said we're using our Creative Expressions palette and we're going to go in with the white and the crimson obviously one's going to be one color the other's going to be the other color and i'm going to probably blow out the opposite color under each if that makes any sense so <clears throat> to fill this in i think i'm going to go with a a brush that i can control slightly but don't have to do too much about it so I'm gonna go in with this brush, just so I can start on the edges of the look. I'm gonna go in with that crimson color over here. And we're just going to start out on the edges. You wanna be inside the base, not on the outside, cause you don't wanna have to do too much cleanup with this. Ooh, you know what I just had an idea of? Yeah, I think I... I think I know how I'm gonna eat this up. Mm -hmm. I'm debating if I'm gonna tell y'all though. 
to be able to tell y'all because I think it's gonna be cool if I can execute. <coughs> had a beef patty too it was good okay so we're gonna i'm gonna go around this whole thing and i'm gonna do the same thing on this side and we're gonna come back okay so now we have both our stars all nice and colored in so what i'm gonna do now is i'm going to outline not outline, but kind of like shade the outside. That's the word I'm looking for. Shade the outside of each star. So I'm gonna do the obviously the opposite. So do white on the outside of this. You're just gonna like lightly tap in that color. Um, if you're if you didn't have like a lot of base, I would use like the excess that's on the outside of these. Um, after you made the star, right, you had some lot of excess left on your brush. I use that to outline again outside of the star just so it's still crisp and kind of like just fan out that um, that base with a concealer brush just so it's not harsh on the outside, but you still have the foundation to you know put some shadow here and really change up the look so i'm gonna just do nice little inserts in the cracks cracks the corners the corners of this i'm only really even kind of tired that's probably why i can't talk I'm actually getting a little sleepy but I'm gonna go throughout this whole thing around the star, making sure I blend this in really nicely and fan it out as I'm doing that, just so it has that nice blur, third out effect. I'm gonna do this whole eyelid with that burgundy look and just do a little bit of blurring out on like the same way I'm doing here on this eye. So once I do that, I'm gonna come back and then you're gonna see how that looks. And probably I might add some extra stuff to it, but I'm not sure yet. But after this, I'll have my face done. So we'll see what the look is giving, okay? But make sure you're using like not too dense brushes, but stuff, something that you can blend with, okay? All right, and this is, this is her. This is she. Now like, I also added little tiny like stardust dots all over my face. I did that using the Ruby Kisses um, white color liner. And I think it really gave the extra that I wanted to have. You know, like the blend on the outside of both of these. First of all, disclaimer, the white, doing white, it's not easy. You're gonna have to keep going over this guy. This didn't take me long at all. This side didn't take me long at all. This one, however, but she eats though. Like, she eats though. Like, I love it. Do y'all love it? I love it. Like, obsessed. Like, I don't know. If y'all going to a, to like, a little concert or something this just get like mm, it just i don't know what it gives me tell me what it gives y'all but it gives me something i can't put my finger on but in like in the grand scheme of things really this is what i was envisioning but not at the same time because really the stars were going to be way smaller than this like they weren't going to be like it wasn't going to be a full half my face type of look but it ended up being that way because as i was drawing the stars i'm like i don't think this is enough i don't think we're going hard enough like and i'm glad we had we had that thought process because look at this this is gorgeous like 
Like, I don't know. You know what? If you're a Cowboys fan, do this, but with the Cowboys colors. I think that would really be so cute for like a little Super Bowl action, little, I don't know, Sunday football day, something like that. I don't know, I don't know. I don't know what to tell y'all do this with, but I just think it eats damn, like, it eats damn. It do, it do. Um, if y'all wanted to know what I had on my lips, though, I do have the Spike Beauty um, lip liner on with um, the Buxom Amanda lip gloss. Yes. Yes. Mwah. No bars. But yeah, I love me a good gloss liner, like 5% tint situation. Um, for the face, the face is the huge, the huge, you know, per. Um, if y'all want my face tutorial, it is on my channel. Y'all should watch it. But yeah, period. I hope that y'all really like this. Um, I'm really just getting back into my creative bag for real because these are the type of looks I like to do, like to be honest. Like I know I can eat a soft glam up, but I'm really not a soft glam girl. I'm a I'm extra. I like a little razzle dazzle. So moving forward, this is probably what y'all gonna see. Stuff like this. So if you want to get in tune with that, click click the like, click the subscribe, click the click the bell, you know, put me put me put me in field. Get, put me on the field, coach. I got you. Okay? Um, but I will put out like soft glam stuff sometimes too. Like, don't get me wrong. This is definitely a versatile, you know, page over here. I just wanted to let y'all know, you know, I'm a creative girly. That's what y'all got. Y'all gonna, y'all gonna see me eat it up. Y'all gonna see me eat it up. But, you know, if y'all have any, um, suge not suggestions, but, um, any, you know, requests. There we go requests for any looks period i will definitely put a tutorial up i really want you guys to really get into your own bag on makeup like it doesn't have to be my bag too like you don't have to be creative but i do want y'all to eat down every every chance i'll get every chance i'll get so you know tell me what y'all want to see tell me what y'all want to listen to um i'm here for the suggestions the requests you know I'm going to try and get to everybody as long as, you know, it's not ridiculous requests. Okay? Keep it cute. Keep it cute in there. But, you know, thanks for being on this journey with me. You know, it's hard being a creator in this world, but we here. We here. So, I appreciate you guys. Mwah. Thanks, Balance Babes. I love you. Um, stay tuned for the next video. Click that bell and you know like and comment below tell me what y'all think i really appreciate you guys have a good one have a great day Mwah. bye